that game stick with you guys? I mean, there's not many often when this team, this organization gets beat that badly, you know, in a game. Is it, is it, or is it just, you know, is that gone now? Do you remember that game? I mean, it's good film. It's really good film to anytime you have uh, film of yourself against that team, whether the, the pieces have changed, um, the play callers are still the same. And uh, obviously, you always are continuing to watch film of yourself, where you were and where you want to be. Um, so obviously, the performance is unacceptable, but there's also some good things that we can take away to build from that, from that game. Today, how much better is this defense than it was a year ago? Well, we're going to have to find out. Uh, I, I, like I said before, I feel very confident with where we are as a team. Uh, like the new guys that we brought in, I feel like we're continuing to get better day by day, having good uh, meeting sessions, which lead to good practices and hopefully good games. People talk a lot about Burrow and Jamar Chase, but how important is it to limit mixing because of what he did last year and how he sort of controlled the game off the of yeah, I mean, they're a very well-balanced offense, and obviously they have a new offensive line, so they feel very confident with them um, to, to run again, run behind them or pass as well. So um, you can't be too caught up in keeping Joe Burrow in the pocket and make sure he doesn't throw forever because then obviously Mixon will get out and uh, run like he did last year. TJ, you got a lot of new guys on the offensive line. What are you expecting from that? Has it been sort of tough preparing for that as the first game? Yeah, it's you don't really have the full uh, five guys working together, so it's been a little bit different, but... We've had that in years past with new guys from different teams. You have to watch the old film and, and things along those lines. But week one is always about focusing on ourselves, too, and um, just being sure that, making sure that we're as prepared as we possibly can and comfortable with our preparation. Speaking of, speaking of talking about yourselves and everything like that, how much pride are you guys trying to, taking in, trying to get better against the run this year? Yeah, we've been preaching that since March, April, um, just trying to be a better run defense. and. Obviously, there's some things that we can do schematically, but ultimately it comes down to guys defeating blocks, making tackles, and not trying to do too much. And uh, like I said, I, I feel very good about where we've been at. We've had a lot of good run, run game meetings, and um, it doesn't matter unless we do it on Sunday, though. Anything more going against the former team? I think it's always fun. You know, you get to see your old teammates and, you know, go against them. I always uh, had to do it last year when we played uh, Cleveland, so it's always exciting. Are you able to help the Steelers offense out a little bit about their tendencies and what they do over there? I think a little bit. You know, guys ask about, you know, different plans and the guys they're going against. And I can kind of give them a couple of tidbits. But, you know, that's through their film study and, uh, film study and their preparedness. But I think the guys are, you know, really focused and locked in. So I'm excited to see them play as well. Obviously a lot of skill over there. Yes, sir. Uh, is this a good barometer for where this defense might be right now? Um, I think it's always good, you know, when you're having a challenge. You know, obviously, you know, they went to the Super Bowl last year. And, you know, they have a lot of special players on their team. So I think it would be a great challenge for us to go out there and just, you know, play, you know, Steelers football. I know the emphasis is always stopping the run. Yeah. Uh, Joe Mixon is probably one of the best around, right? What, what do you guys have to do to kind of contain him? Um, play to our keys, you know, attack the football, knock the line of scrimmage back. You know, I have nothing but respect for Joe as a runner and as a player. So, you know, it's going to be good. Larry, you were on the other side of things last year. What was the look like in the Bengals locker room after, after the wins against the Steelers? Exciting. You know, the Steelers have always been kind of that staple, that standard, you know, in the AFC North. So um, being able to give her that hump last year was really important. And we had talked about it, you know, before the game. It just was kind of you know, that deciding factor game to kind of really gauge us so and kind of push us over the edge. So when we got that W, it was a lot of energy.